What's going on everybody? My name is Tatiana Jade. Welcome to my channel if you are new here. Today I'm going to be doing a seasonal simple glam for this time of year. And if we're doing any Zoom thingies with our family, this will make it look like you didn't just wake up. So let's get started. Right now I'm going to go in with the Soft Focus Glow Drops from BoxyCharm and I'm going to use that as a primer and just put it down on my face and that piece of hair is sticking out and it's getting on my nerves, oh my god! I cannot tell you how much this smells so good. <laughs> it smells so good you guys if you have it use it it is the absolute best primer i've ever used y'all yes yes it is so i'm just gonna rub that all in my face make sure it's all moisturized and once it's all good and sticky yum, we are going to move on to the rest of the face So now that I kind of have my brows shaped the way I want, I'm going to go in with a brow pencil. And I'm sorry, but I forgot the name and brand of it. But it's a dark brown uh, eye pencil. Or, ah, eye brow pencil. So I'm just going to fill in my brows and try to make them look half decent, I suppose. Side note, do not put the primer in your eyebrows. It will make it very hard to fill them in. As you can see, it's all sticky and it's really hard so that was my bad oops yeah these brows are not the greatest i should just show up on zoom like this yeah so now i'm just going to take some concealer this is the born this way concealer in the color golden and i'm just going to try to clean up my eyebrows and shape them as much as possible I'm so lazy. I really didn't feel like doing any of this today, but <laughs> I should just show up like this and see if anybody notices. Hi! Conceal, don't feel, don't let them in. Oh, wait, I forgot the lyrics. Well, you guys know where I'm going with that. Actually, that's pretty good. That's what you call skill. Yeah. Next, I'm going in with my handy dandy tape and I'm going to make those edges sharp. I always put concealer down on my eyelids before I do any eyeshadow. People who don't do that, you cannot trust them, okay? That's weird. You must put eyeshadow. Oh wait, <laughs> you must put concealer before the eyeshadow. And the stupid concealer brush was not blending as well as I wanted it to. So I'm going to switch to a sponge and blend it out. So it doesn't look like I'm painting. So instead of eyeshadow, I'm putting down mattifying setting powder on my eyelids so that they're not greasy. Then I'm going in with this brush set from Pure Cosmetics. And then I'm going in with this eyeshadow palette from ColourPop, which has some really pretty pinks and purples in it. All right, I'm too lazy to get up off this couch and go look at all the colors that I put. I'll put them down in the description for y'all. But this look that I'm going for is uh, one that I got off of Instagram. It's like a, well, I'm not gonna give it away. You'll just see. So now for the umpteenth time, I'm going to attempt a cut crease on my eyelid. And surprisingly, it actually turned out okay. I was a little shooketh. So we're going to try to do that and do a little glimmer glam on top of it and see how that turns out. Thank you. 
So in that same ColourPop palette, I'm going to use one of the really bright, it's like a rose gold type of color and put it right over the uh, cut crease. It looks really, really pretty. It almost kind of blends in with the concealer, but it has more shimmer and shimmer in it. So it's, yeah, it's pretty. Next, I'm going in with an oldie but goodie, the Modern Renaissance palette from Anastasia Beverly Hills, and I'm going to take the color Red Ochre. As you can see, it has been used and abused, um, but I'm going to take the color Red Ochre and put it in the corners of my eye because I actually want it to have more of a red hue than purple. Um, so I'm just going to blend and blend and blend until I can't blend no more. And then I'm going to take uh, the really dark brown color that's in that palette. I forgot the name of it, doggone it. But uh, I'm going to put that um, at the bottom of the crease just to give it a little bit more depth um, and make it look more fall. And then we're going to keep blending. Then we're going to blend some more. <laughs> Next up is Fenty Eyeliner in the color because I'm black, which uh, is very fitting. Um, so I'm going to take that into a nice drawn out wing and use my trusty napkin and push down my stupid eyelashes that always get in the way and then I have eyeliner eyelashes which nobody wants so that's why I'm using the napkin and I'm going to do that on the other eye until we have a nice wing Now it is time for the tape removal. So let's get that off and have the final reveal. And oof, y'all see that line? Can cut a steak, it's so sharp. Yas, look at it, look at it. Ooh, yeah, yeah. And that side, yeah. Ooh, it's so sharp, yeah. Ooh, I like it, yeah, yeah. Ooh, look at that, look at it, look at it. Uh, oh, oh, well, let me stop. <laughs> So if you haven't noticed, I use Fenty Beauty a lot. I absolutely love the brand. And I'm going in with the um, Pro Filter Foundation in the color 320, and I'm going to paint my face with it, all over with it. I'm going to paint it and blend it all in with my skin. And I didn't even mean to rhyme that, but it rhymed. So I'm going to go in with the brush from the pure bottle that I showed y'all earlier and just put it all over and yeah, I love it. I love it. And oh my god, I almost went over my eyebrow. Good god, help me. Whoo, whoo. Yeah, don't do that. And then the darn brush ain't doing it for me, so I'm going in with a sponge. Believe it or not, I am trying to go for a subtle look here. <laughs> um, but I'm going in with the Born This Way Concealer underneath my eyes in the color Golden. And let's get tribal up in here. Let's put it all over. Yeah, brighten, brighten. Let's do it. Then we gonna blend it out with a sponge. Next, I'm going in with the Ultimate Glow Palette from Real Her uh, from BoxyCharm, and I'm going to give myself a nose using the contouring color uh, in there. Not contouring, uh, what do you call it? Bronzer color. Jeez, help me. Next, I'm going in with some mattifying setting powder all under my eyes and my T-zone and my smile lines, all of it. Well, it all gets greasy real fast and nobody needs greasy. Nobody, especially me. So that's what I'm doing. Next, 
Next, the finale for this look. I'm going in with the Ciate palette. I don't care if that's how you say it or not. That's how I say it. Um, from BoxyCharm that I got last month. And there's a really, really pretty green color in there. It's like a dark forest green with shimmer in it. And I'm putting that under uh, my eye um, because my shirt is green and I'm trying to actually match. So uh, that's what I'm doing. Uh, unfortunately, it's not really showing up that well. Um, it did in my mirror, but on camera, it's not picking it up very well at all. Um, so I'm actually going to go in with a um, palette that I have from uh, Makeup Revolution. Um, and it's like all greens. So I'm going to use a couple of those colors in there. Unfortunately, they're not labeled. So I have no idea what colors they are. Um, but yeah, that's what I'm doing. So I'm going to go in with the Modern Renaissance palette and use the color, the brown color that's in there um, and try to smoke it out a little bit, which was such a bad idea. I wish I hadn't done that because now it just looks dirty and it washed out all the green. So uh, <laughs> I'm going to have to clean that up with some concealer, which just made me mad. But oh well, I'll just have to try to fix it. Um, and then I'm going to try to put uh, like a really nice bright color uh, in the corners of my eye inner corners and then I'm using the blush um, from the ultimate glow palette and highlighter from that palette too which is blinding I love it I want more I want my face to be illuminated do you hear me I want it shining like the sun and I want it glimmering and glistening I want it looking dripping wet and oh my god yes 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 give it to me oh yeah look at it it's liquid gold oh yeah oh yes yes I've known for a long time that I have issues. If you're just finding out, I'm sorry, but I want it all over my face. So now I'm going over that green with more green so that it can actually look green and not like dirt that's been smeared or that I've been crying and that's my mascara or something. Nobody needs that. Now I'm going in with the color Espresso from NYX Cosmetics. That's my favorite lip liner in case you can't I use it in every video um, but yeah it's the best one that lines my lips it gives it the most definition I love it now I'm going in with this uh, lip gloss that I got last month from BoxyCharm that I haven't used <laughs> um, it's a really pretty color I like it it's like a light pink yeah there, there it is um, but it works um, but I wanted a little lighter so I'm going in with the color butter from NYX Cosmetics too and I'm gonna put that over it so yeah so like a complete spaz, I totally forgot to do mascara since I'm not doing any lashes today. So I'm using this mascara from Lily Lashes in the color black. And I'm going to attempt to not get that on anything else on my face. So I'm doing it very carefully right now to try to make my eyelashes stand out as much as they can on camera. So here's how everything looks after we're all done. <laughs> I'm so upset. <laughs> this is not how this was supposed to go. I'm just not all here today. Um, but yeah, uh, let me know if you enjoyed the look. It was fun doing it, kind of. I just, I'm not in the mood to do very much. Uh, as you can see, I've been kind of MIA lately. I've just been taking some me time and time with my family, so. Um, yeah this is the final look uh let me know if there's any looks that you would like me to do if you see anything on instagram or something that you would like me to recreate um but yeah this was kind of like a fall seasonal type of look and that stupid smile lines that i have i need to get that out yes <clears throat> so like comment and subscribe on the video and everybody stay safe wear your masks and take care i love you Bye-bye.